வெல்கம் பேக் எவ்ரிபடி நான் வந்து இஸ் பார்ட் வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு டிசைன் தி சைட் கண்டெய்ன் அண்ட் சைட் வால் ரைட் ஸோ ஆஸ் அ சைட் அர்லியர் வி ஹாவ் டூ மெயின் எலிமெண்ட் இயர் தட் இஸ் சைட் கண்டெய்ன் அண்ட் சைட் வால் அண்ட் வி நீட் டு அலைன் தேம் சைட் பை சைட் அண்ட் ஃப்ளோர் தி கண்டெய்ன் ஓகே ஸோ லெட்ஸ் டு தேட் ஸோ ஹியர் ஆஸ் யூ கேன் சி ஐ ஹாவ் டூ எலிமெண்ட்ஸ் தட் இஸ் சைட் கண்டெய்ன் அண்ட் சைட் வால் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஆஃப் ஆல் ஐ எம் கோயிங் டு புட் திஸ் போத் டிவிஷன்ஸ் இன் டு ஒன் அதர் டிவிஷன் called as wrapper okay let me call them call this division as a wrapper and inside this i'm going to paste that two tv two elements content and the side bar so if we do like this and it will be easier for us to float the content later on the on the uh, when we start designing this okay go here okay last name is side content and another one is side bar right so i want it to have width of 70% and i want it to float to left same here width of 30% and i want it to float to left okay now let's see Okay, as you can see here, the side content and sidebar are both side by side, but so we need to overflow, hide the overflow first. So that's why I had created that wrapper class here. Okay, wrapper division. Now I'm I'm going to overflow the hide the overflow in wrapper class. Overflow. let me refresh the page okay now it's working right so now they are both side by side what we need to do now here is that i want to give heading for this both both elements okay so here is recent posts and here is sidebar i want this both element to have same class name that is let's say heading class heading now i want to style this heading first background same as previous 9688 padding let's give 1 ram okay let's see how it looks okay but you notice here that they are both uh, joined together okay so we need to give a uh, few margin to the here okay so that we can distinguish between the this element and this sidebar element so what i'm going to do is i'm going to reduce 0.5% from the both side 69.5 and 29.5 and i'm going to um give margin right 0.5% let's see how it looks okay this looks good and also i want to give padding of 5 pixel to the wrapper so that both looks inside this okay yeah that's what i want also i want to change the color from the heading colors this should be here color i want it to have white okay the headings look good now uh it's time for us to add few post that we had here like this okay so for that i'm going to create a division called as having the class posts let's just say post inside that i want it to have uh post info 
So post info will have title of the blog post. Welcome to our new blog and websites. Okay. And also I want you to have mm, by some of this text so let me select and delete it I think this much is enough also we have uh, image here okay so I want to put one image here the source is img slash feature dot jpg I don't have this image yet so let me import this image from the desktop first uh, 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 hmm. i have one image here okay, let's copy this one or let's say this one night king okay so that is inside let me cancel this first let's open this directory go to inside image and paste here and i want to remain uh, rename this image to feature okay and also featured here yeah. so let's go ahead and replay refresh the page okay uh, let me give this image height and width of 100% so that it will fit the given area post mg width Okay, here we have multiple posts they are floated together okay so there is two posts here first one is this one and second one is this one and all of them are floated at the left so just like how we had uh, float these two element uh, recent post and sidebar we can do the same we can follow the same idea here so let me do that post I want post to have 50% width and I want it to float to left. I want to have background of uh, C. Let's say sky blue. Okay, little, little too much blue, but you get the idea right so uh, I want you to have I want this image to have fixed height okay height I would say 300 pixel so that we can give margin left to one percent okay now all you need to do is copy and paste this division several times together right so why well, now we need to check here let 
we inspect the HTML element and check what's going on. It is I think maybe due to the width of the yeah. If I give 47.5, is, is it working? Yes. Six. Yeah. Seven. Yeah. Eight. Okay. 47.99. Let me give 47.99 here. Yes. Okay. Now I need to give margin button. Five pixel. Let's see how it looks. Yes. Okay guys now you can change the colors or you can give a link here you can modify it as you like okay so I'm going to stop here forgot that I need to create login and register page but I think I'll do that in next video okay see you guys in next video